Assalamu alaikum my everyone. So today's video is on how to make a double V hijab or a double triangular hijab, anything you want to call it. If you haven't subscribed, be able to tap the subscribe button to subscribe and tap the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Yeah. So this is what a hijab should look like after sewing. The final outcome of a hijab. So let's get started. I'm going to be working with one and a half yard of fabric. My scissor slip, hula, and my chalk. So the first thing I'm going to do is to cut out my shorter piece. So I just cut out about 30 inches in my fabric. So I have 30 inches. And my fabric is in fold. So the next thing I'm going to do is to take my head circumference divided by 2. So my head circumference is 20 divided by 2, that's 10 inches. So I'm just going to mark 10 inches there. So from the 10 inches point, I'm just going to mark 17 inches. I have a video on how to make triangular hijab. The link is in the description box. So for you to understand better what I'm doing, Endeavor to watch it. I'm just going over it for those that might be viewing my channel for the first time. So from that 10 inches point, I'll just take 17 inches. And I'm just going to mark it. So from that 17 inches point to the 10 inches point, I'm just going to make a line to connect the two points. After which I'm going to take the edge of my back thing and I'm going to place it at the front edge. So I have my midpoint already. So at that midpoint, I'm just going to go up by 9 inches. So from that 9 inches point, I'm just going to make a curve to join the edge of my front and my back. So I'm just going to trace my line. So when you open it, you have something like this. So I'm just going to notch the midpoint. So the next thing I'm going to do is just to place this piece, the first piece we cut on my remaining fabric. To create our longer piece. So I'm just going to go ahead to take 3 inches, so I'll just mark 3 inches down the round. And I'm just going to go ahead to cut it out. So we have the longer and the shorter piece already. So I'm just going to notch the two parts, the midpoint of both parts. So the next thing is to cut a hijab cap. To know what to fold, you need about 22 inches by 8 inches fabric. So I'm just going to fold this into four. After folding into form, I'm going to take my jab cap width, which I want to be about 4 inches. 
then my x circumference divided by 2 which is 10 inches so I'm just going to make a curve joining those two points I'm just going to cut it out After which I will notch the midpoint. So to sew it now, I have my shutter piece. I'm going to put it aside. Then I'll just open up my longer piece. And I'm just going to place it down, making sure that I'm, I'm noticing the notched parts. Then I'm going to take the shutter piece. And I'm going to place the notch part of the longer one and the shorter one. And I'm going to place my cap. So basically, I have my longer piece first, followed by my shorter piece and then my cap. Then I'm going to start painting from the notch part. So I'm just going to pin the three pieces together. So after pinning, that's what we're going to have. I'll just take it to my sewing machine now and then sew that part. So after sewing, I have this. And at the right side, this is what it looks like. The next thing is just for us to join the front part of our hijab. So I'm just going to fold it right side facing each other. Then taking the four parts together, that is the two for the longer one and the two for the shorter one. I'm just going to make sure the four parts are aligned and I'm just going to pin it all down. So after pinning it all, I have that. So I'll just take it to my sewing machine now and then sew it. So I'm done sewing and I'm just going to turn it to the right side for you to have a better view. So at the right side, that's it. So the next thing is just to hem the down part of our job. So just turn the down part and that's all for the hijab for you to understand better on the v hijab please endeavor to check out the video on the triangular hijab the link is in my description box so that's the final outcome of our hijab i hope you find this tutorial helpful and if you do endeavor to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching And I'm going to see you in my next video.